Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying some Granny Goose potato chips. I have just the regular potato chips. These are the wavy regular potato chips, and these are uh, the barbecue chips. And yes, they are as big as they look. They're huge. <laughs> They're absolutely massive bags. They were $4.99, which I think is it's pretty super cheap. cheap for the amount of that you get. Yes, for sure. $4.99 at World Market, and they are 22 ounces. So, 624 grams of potato chips. Uh, this is the size like you would see in some place like GFS. Probably. Yeah. yeah, something like that. It's just a big bag. Like for big cookouts and stuff. Yes, and I'm, I'm, I wondered, um, we had bought some chips and tried them from GFS and I, I don't remember, um, I would have to watch my own video to see who made them because I do recognize on the back it says, Snack King, King of Snacks. Um, it is Snack King Fork in Los Angeles, California. I wonder where the ones that we did, the ones that we reviewed from GFS, I wondered if it was maybe the same group of people that made these. I don't, I don't remember. Well, these are almost a pound and a half of chips. <laughs> yeah, it, it's a lot of chips. It's uh, one ounce, 28 grams, about 16 chips is 150 calories. It says potato chips, what's in the bag, Goose? Uh, famous for great tasting chips and snacks, Granny Goose has been producing quality snacks since 1946. Granny Goose is committed to selling the highest quality snacks and uses only the finest ingredients. We start with select chipping potatoes, slice them for maximum crispness, fry them golden brown and tumble season them while they are still warm for a better tasting snack choose the best granny goose we just never heard of them mm -hmm. so if you are in los angeles california maybe you've heard of them. maybe you have different flavors you bring that bag and go <laughs> white chips everywhere <laughs> This is truly like a cookout size, oh, yeah. like mm -hmm. for a, a family reunion or something. A now, lot of people. Now, they're a darker chip. They are a darker chip. Um, they do visually look different than like a Lay's potato chips. Lay's potato chips are very uh, light. and they're bleached out. Yeah, and these, uh, these do look more uh, like a traditional potato. Whatever they cook those in mm -hmm. has a very good flavor. Mm -hmm. But they're good. Mm -hmm. That's a good chip. They're. It's comparable to like a Lay's. I don't think they're quite as oily, but. That's what I was gonna say. They're not as greasy, and they don't have as much salt. They don't have quite as much salt, but I do like them. I like them salt. too. They taste more like real potato. Yeah, they're more potatoy than. Mm -hmm. But they're still but they're, so. Yes, they're they're very good. Okay. I was gonna open, but I don't know if you read the calories first. Um, I wonder if they're the same. I think they're the same. Sixteen chips and they're fifty. Thank you. Because I can't really. The bag's so big; it's hard to see. Yeah. <laughs> So these should taste the same, but in wavy. They're good dipping chips. Usually. Yes. Mm. Texture is a little different because they are thicker. That's a good chip too. I like those better. Um, the salt's still not more, quite as much, but, but I it's think they, better. I think they have more salt, and it probably because they are wavy, it holds that salt mm -hmm. better. I, I think these are, these come across as a lot saltier. You know what those remind me of? These have 140. You know the potato sticks? Yeah. The flavor of those reminds me of the potato sticks you can buy. Okay. And these do have more sodium. These have 140 milligrams. These have um, 135. So even though that doesn't sound like a lot, it is a difference. It is a little bit. Yeah. So those, those are saltier and for me, I would rather buy those. I yeah. would rather eat those. No, and, that, and they're good the dipping chips. Yeah. The flavor is still really good potato flavor. And you said 60 chips, 150, it's the same. Same thing. So these are the barbecue. 
barbecue. So barbecue's different with every chip, you know? So it'll be interesting. Um, I know, I know they haven't had a lot of foldovers. No, I know. You know me, I like the foldovers. Yeah, you, you don't get a lot oh, of foldovers. I found one. Hmm. That has a good smoky flavor. Yes, it does. That keeps you wanting more. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the smoke is really good. Mm -hmm. It has a little bit of a, a sweet spice to it. It's not. Mm, those are good. There's no heat to them. Mm, um, no. They're not going to like burn your throat, anything like that. It, yeah, it's a sweet, smoky barbecue. Mm -hmm. But I very much like that. Yeah, if you like a smoky sauce or smoky barbecue, then you'll really like these. They're I really would good. like these, uh, this flavor in the wavy. Yeah, that'd be good. Um, and they yeah. might make them. Yeah, I think that would be really good. Uh, the sodium on these is 190. No, no. That really. makes sense because of the, the barbecue and everything. Yeah, uh, those are good. Those are my favorite. Are they your favorite? Yeah, um, now, if I'm going to eat them just as a snack or with shit, with a burger or a sandwich on them, I would get the barbecue. Mm -hmm. For dipping, though, I'd get the, the wavy ones, the yeah. little ones or whatever you want. Yeah, and, and the traditional are good. They're Like we said, they're... They're just not as, quite as salty. Um, and I, th I just think the wavy ones are better for dipping because they're yeah. thicker. It's a thicker chip. But I do think they're very good quality. Oh yeah, these are excellent chips. And it's, we always love trying different potato chips. And for the price. You can't, you can't beat the price. No, the very, and that's the thing is you go in world market and they have them one week, you might go in world market in two weeks and you don't ever see that. They might not have them now. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, right now as you're watching this video, they might not have these anymore. They could have sold out of these by now. Um, so I, I, you just have to, it's something that you have to look for. But I would be curious to know if you are in California, do you always see these at all the grocery stores? Is this a popular brand? Are they in smaller bags? <laughs> yeah, really. Are they always this massive? Because this is like buying one of those multi mill bags of cereal. Yeah, the yeah, bag. that would be the comparison. Yeah. It's just absolutely huge. Because the family size bags of chips that are in here are one pound bags. Yeah. And these are a pound and a half. Yeah. <laughs> Almost a pound and a half. Jumbo. Yeah. So, yeah. So, uh, I would be interested to know just what you're getting in California. So, I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.